Piss kind of hops. <laughs> Welcome to the charge. I'm Sir Franklin, and we're taking to the field today. But something bad is on the moon. Uh, short, sweet sci-fi horror. What more could you ask for? I'm glad you're here. Let's ride. <clears throat> <clears throat> I'm clear my throat. Uh, 1972 marked the date of the last publicly disclosed moon landing. Since then, eight classified lunar missions were authorized in absolute secrecy. Government hiding secrets? What? I found the video recording which instigated those class classified missions. I can't read today. That's okay. Something is on the moon. And somehow, when I saw this footage last week, I think it noticed me. Oh, like you could see you through the footage, kind of like the ring? Recorded December 20th, 1972, final public lunar mission, Lieutenant Marcus Rents Helcam, Helmcam footage. Tranquility Helcam. Base, this is Houston. You are go for EVA. Please confirm status of your suit systems and PLSS before proceeding to the equipment site. Over. Roger. Roger that, Houston. This is Tranquility. Suit systems are green across the board. PLSS is operating within nominal parameters. Preparing to egress the LM. Over. Okay, not bad. Copy Tranquility. Take your first steps carefully. The radar receiver at radar site November has recently failed. Its last telemetry sweep before your EVA noted a transient signal. 1,500 miles southwest of your position. Likely a sensor echo. Proceed with manual receiver reset. Over. Understood, Houston. It's eerie out here. Reminds me of my last walk on the lunar surface. The solitude. The silence. No. The human brain craves faces. And this solitude oh. makes me see them <laughs> in the hills. I don't know where I'm going. What's the waypoint now? Cool. Like the dialogue. It's funny, Apollo 11 was the only mission where no one said they saw faces in the rock. Must be hard to think about anything else when you're the first people to ever touch the moon, I suppose. Ever since then, someone on every lunar mission has mentioned it. Over. I like the dialogue, just trying to make sure we can hear it, I guess. Houston. I'll make sure to inform you if any little green men pop out of the ground and eat me. Until then, though. I'm en route to the radio installation. Over and out. There we go. Okay. I, I hate, like, talking over the dialogue. I know I kind of was. Uh, but I gotta say, this looks pretty good. I like how they've set this up. Um, you know, pretty straightforward. But I like that we kind of have the distance mapped up here. I appreciate that we can kind of see a little bit of the inside of our helmet. Um, feet check. No feet. That's okay. We can run. It seems very similar to running on Earth. I figured the gravity would be a little different here. But maybe it's a conspiracy. We're not actually on the moon. Oh, jumping. Jumping is interesting. What if we're running and we jump off this hill? Nice! Okay, maybe that's the way to go. Look at that! I would be jumping the whole time if I was on the moon. Not that you could get me up there, though. I'm all for sci-fi. I love it. I'm all for sci-fi video games. I'm good on going up there myself. I like having my feet on the ground. Appreciate the start. Tranquility, be advised. Another lunar radar installation, 2300 miles east. Reported a brief unidentified object crossing the lunar horizon, then went dark. Similar profile to your anomaly. It's puzzling, but proceed as planned. Over. So copy. When I reach the radar, I'll make an assessment of the receiver's functionality. Tell me though, what is believed to be the source of the radar signatures? Over. Copy tranquility. Current theory is high velocity micrometeoroid, or possibly debris. Anomalous, but not unprecedented. Maintain focus on your objective. Over. 
Roger that, Houston. I have to admit that this situation has put me a bit on edge. I think I've been seeing things that aren't really there. Maybe just Where? reflections off my visor. I just keep staring at the hills. Over. Tranquility. We are confident that the mission state is nominal. Stay calm and focus on fixing the receiver. You'll get some rest soon. Update us when you reach the radar site. Over and out. All right, I, I do appreciate the dialogue. It's kind of interesting, helps paint the picture. I guess that's kind of what they're mainly using to tell the story here. Um, so some station saw something across uh, across their field of vision or something like that on their radar. Um, they didn't know what it was and then they went dark. So that's not good. Uh, go <laughs> I was trying to say good and great, came out good. Um, but that's not great news. Uh, so I get why this guy's nervous, although we haven't been seeing, at least I haven't been seeing, what he's claiming is reflecting off his visor. Jump, space, jump, jump. Okay, we've arrived. Look at this. Oh, this is... Come in. I've made it to the radar site. Over. Roger. Tranquility. We need you to assess the condition of the receiver and run a system reboot. After the reboot completes, stand by, as we will need to ensure that the reboot fixes the system. But be advised over the last few minutes, almost all lunar installations have experienced significant technical problems. Uh oh. The cause is currently unknown. Over. Awesome. Understood, Houston. Something about this situation just isn't right. The receiver looks perfectly fine to me. No damage at all. All diagnostics are green, but the receiver is failing to detect any return signatures. I'll reboot the system now. Over. Roger, tranquility. Update us if the situation changes. Over. I gotta say, I appreciate that um, there is a large button that says hard reset. Not a complicated thing. I'm a simple guy, so I do appreciate this. Boop. Okay. Good. Oh, yeah. Your eyes could play tricks on you. Looking like, you know, there's stuff on the horizon. It's probably just the stars or something. Alright, what is this? Oh. Okay. Radar is operational tranquility. Well done. I'm seeing the scans on my screen right now. It looks good. Um, tranquility. I'm picking up a small object traveling in your direction right now. It's moving fast, very fast. I cannot get a read on the exact speed. Patching into your HUD now. It's 2,250 miles away. Please return to the capsule. Oh, that's not good. Uh-oh. Okay. Oh, it's fast. Oh, that is fast. Oh, it's getting faster. Uh-oh. Tranquility? Oh, tranquility? Tranquility. We need you to stay where you are. Please do not move. You are safe here. You uh. are safe. You. You are safe here. Oh, it's getting darker. We need you to stay where you are. Please do not move. You are safe here. Yikes. Tranquility, the command module has begun its journey back to Earth. Please. Stay where you are, stay calm. Run, man, and run. We'll recover you shortly. Oh, dude. No, 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 no. What is that? Oh, no. Anyway. It's just a red. Oh, weird. All right. 
Come on. <laughs> We're just kind of hops. <laughs> what? <laughs> All right. I'm fine. Are you okay? Are you okay? Is it just me? We're both fine. Yeah. Okay, good. Glad to hear that. That was fun. Short little game, but I enjoyed it. I appreciate the dialogue that was kind of the main, you know, medium there. Uh, it's good. It's solid. For what it was, I appreciated that. Short, sweet, scary at the very end. Gives you a little bit of apprehension. I like how they used the little, um, the distance reader to, um, to show you that, hey, you don't have a lot of time. This thing's coming in fast. And, um, and that it was, you know, the red glare disappeared. You think you're safe sort of and then you get the jump scare i do appreciate it nothing was overdone it was good so thank you um to whoever created that i do appreciate that uh, again that is something scary is on the moon if you like watching these videos i would ask that you support the channel by subscribing liking commenting or sharing i know you hear it all the time on youtube from creators but it really does help and it really does make a difference in the end if you've made it all the way to the end here thank you for tuning in and hanging out as we took to the field today, but something is bad on the field. I will see you on the next battlefield. Till then.